I'm a caretaker of my wife, and along with watching her suffer with her illness, I struggle with sexual tension. I'm trying to suppress it so it won't matter if we have a sexless, low intimacy marriage, but I'm feeling guilty about those times when I relieve the tension myself. How do I take care of her and take care of myself too? This is common when you are in a caretaking situation and I'm going to say even for new parents out there, sleepless nights, you're taking care of infants, many times intimacy between the couple suffers, maybe one of the first things to suffer. This particular writer says, I'm trying to suppress it so it won't matter, I'm going to stop you right there. It does matter. If, if you have any life left in you at all, after you take care of the needs of everybody on your list, I'm going to give you the permission. <laughs> I am going to give you the permission. If you're feeling sexual, relieve it. Masturbation is about honoring your body. Listen, caretaking is tough. And it, it's not relegated to a sick spouse. Uh, the, the needs of young children Lots of parents who have babies and toddlers in the house, they're suffering too with sexless or low intimacy marriage. They're tired at the end of the day. After taking care of everyone else, what's left for you? I would tell you, if at all you feel stirred even after everybody's needs have been taken care of, honor that in yourself. If you had a cold, you would take care of yourself. If, you have, if you're hungry, you take care of yourself. Sexual needs are the same way. They are absolutely the same way. Take care of yourself. Masturbation is what I'm talking about. And my personal viewpoint is, there is no shame. You would take care of your body in any other way. This is the same.